Hi friends, it's Tina coming to you guys from my humble abode, my camper. Um, I have some news to update you guys on. So I know in my last video I told you that I was going to get the injection. So that is scheduled for February 4th. I'm going to go in and get just one injection and that is hopefully supposed to take care of any issues for up to a year. What it does is it puts gel into the knee space and it will um, kind of act as cartilage in there so there won't be any bone on bone rubbing. Uh, I know I told you guys that the doctor gave me the okay so I'm going to be hiking this year. So I wanted to take the time to just drop a few lines and announce to you guys that I've been um, getting final gear um, for my hike and I went ahead and already registered with the ATC so I have my date um, and Bella's in the background watching videos so if you hear her that's her um, it's raining and cold so we didn't do anything this weekend um, and I'm just getting over having a virus so anyway um, I got my puffy jacket I got my shoes that I will start out with which will be the oboes um, low something or another I have it written down I can't remember right off the bat um, I had ultras and I believe that those really helped um, cause some problems with my hiking obviously not all the knee damage I had but they're just not supportive enough for me right now maybe later on down the road because I did like them they were comfortable um, I do really like the oboes. I've only wore them a few times out walking the dogs and then I wore them all day at work just to see if they caused any issues with my feet and they were fine. So plus oboes has a really great deal for through hikers. If you buy one pair and you're a through hiker, they will give you two pair for free during your through hike. So I'm going to try um, to use those and then that will take care of hopefully two more pair. As long as they work out for me, I'm open to whatever. I also have a pair of Brooks Cascadias that I got from Rob at Outdoor 76. I went and saw him, I believe it was in May, um, and you know, spent probably a couple of hours with him. Wound up going back um, in October when I left from hiking with Micey. I went and picked those up at that point because I was still hiking in my ultras and just was having a lot of pain. So anyway, um, I did upgrade my sleeping pad to the um, Neo Air x Lite, the women's. I believe it's 12 ounces, so I'm happy with that so far. I haven't slept on it yet, but I did blow it up and I laid on it and tried to get comfortable a little bit. It doesn't seem like it's going to be too bad. It's a lot shorter than the one that I had before. but the one that I had before I felt like took up so much room in my tent, which I had the um, Big Agnes um, Mountain Glow UL2, um, why can't I think right now? Um, I'll put it in the link or something below or pop in a picture or something. But anyway, um, I have now returned that because I don't like the front entry. I've returned that and I got the um, Tiger Wall UL2. Heard really great things about it. I think it's a difference of a couple of ounces, um, but it has two doors. And then during the hot months, I can open up both, um, you know, um, open it up for airflow to come through if it's hot as long as it's not raining and stuff but anyway um, so I upgraded that I haven't slept in that yet or tried it out but I think it'll do just fine I'm hoping to get out and maybe set it up and do an overnight in it before I leave for the trail um, and what else have I upgraded to I can't remember off the top of my head because I'm just throwing this together as a quick update um, so, for the final date, I went ahead and registered. I'm going to be skipping the approach trail because I just don't want to do it. I don't see the need in it. It's not part of the Appalachian Trail counting towards the miles. So, and I know it's just an extra day, but 
I have a specific, specific amount of time that I need to get the trail done in and I really just don't want to do it. We may go up and hike up to the falls with me and my husband and my daughter um, the day before I leave. But other than that, um, I'm going to just start from Springer on March 24th. Um, if you guys have any questions, um, put them in the comments below. I would love to answer them for you. And um, stay tuned for more updates. And I will try and do um, gear, um, what I will be carrying with me and clothing and things like that over the next few weeks. Um, so thanks for watching, guys, and stay tuned. Bye.